me, bitchy, here back giving you another show. Here with a lot of hot topics and a lot of world news. Let's jump right into this uh, with this young thug versus the game. And I just want to say, stupid. Beef, really? It's 2015. Beef to me is so 1997, so 1990, you know, 8 and 9, before the millennium came and, you know, people just started getting money in music. Beef to me is Portillo's beef, you know, a beef dipped with extra juice on the side. Dipped with hot peppers. That's what beef is to me. Um, Young Thug in the game, stop. Hopefully it doesn't come to blows. Both of y'all got guns. Both of y'all got people who may shoot for y'all. So hopefully nobody has to die over some stupid shit. Like, why are y'all really fighting? Okay, you don't like somebody. Okay, you don't like somebody. You just don't like them. <laughs> you know how many people I don't like? And it's a few right now, <laughs> if you haven't noticed. If you're not, you know, being nosy boots. Um, It's a lot of people who I don't like. Okay, you just don't like them. Life goes on. Life twirls on in my Kenya voice. We will get to her in a minute. But I want to get to these Dallas shootings, you guys, and talk about these Dallas shootings, I guess, to, um, I don't know if they were extremists or whatever they were. Um, went down in Dallas, Texas, bitch. There was a draw, Muhammad. Something about Muhammad and just being disrespectful to people's religion, which is extremely stupid. Stop worrying about other people. We got to live our own lives. And I'm going to get to that in a second. So supposedly ISIS claims that these were, you know, members of ISIS who went down here and shot these people. I don't know exactly what happened, but I just want to say, just stop worrying about everybody else. Just stop worrying about everybody else. Don't put yourself in any situations where you're going and disrespecting people's religions and stuff like that. And just don't do stuff like that. Don't put yourself in a situation where the cops can get you. Don't put yourself in a situation where you're disrespecting someone's religion and can be shot. Just try to avoid that at all costs. That's my advice. Um, I want to talk about the Met Gala, and I need to give a shout out to my girls, B. Of course, Beyonce giving me this bohemian Barbie tease, sparkling dress, sickening nude underneath, with the Shanene ponytail giving me life. Um, I want to give a shout out to Reed with the long, sickening yellow, just sickening long ass yellow thing that she had on. Um, and JLo, yes man for the nude with the red, looking like a red dragon. Yes man, mama. C. Um, People who I didn't like so much was really Solange. I didn't feel that big. I just didn't like the overlay of that big ass thing on that dress. Like, I didn't really like it. Um, I want to talk about Housewives Reunion Part 2. Part 3 will be on this Sunday, and I will be reviewing that next week. Um, Part 2 was okay. You know, the husbands came out. And, um, bitch, I need to give a yes ma'am to Nene. I love Nene. I don't care how rude and shady she is. I love a shady bitch. I'm a shady bitch, so why wouldn't I love a shady bitch like Nene? She said, hold up, bitch, hold up, hold up, bitch. No, bitch. He has a prize, bitch. I love Nene. She had me dying. Um, I'm tired of Kenya. Kenya gotta go. I'm tired of Kenya. Kenya can stay because she may bring a little bit of shade, but I'm tired of Claudia. Claudia really has to go. And I'm tired of um Cynthia. Cynthia, you can go too. Sit up there looking like Muffy Crosswire. Wasn't feeling it. Yes, ma'am. The only people who I really love is Nene, Phaedra, um, Portia. Kenya can stay for kicks because she is going to bring a little bit of tea. And maybe Cynthia can stay, but Claudia got to go. Um, I want to talk about loving hip-hop, y'all. Um, and talk about, you know, supposedly, or no, let's talk about loving hip-hop. Mimi and Jocelyn's meeting, bitch, totally was stupid to do. You knew they were going to go at each other. She, Jocelyn, shut the fuck up. And Jocelyn, I'm not, I'm not going to go at her because I, 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 I change my life and I'm doing better with myself. I... I, I'm being stingy with my cootie cat. Stingy with my cootie cat, really. And y'all was living for that. That's a shame. Shows you for these Atlanta people. Um, and then uh, I hope y'all was, you know, safe a week ago when um, let me start throwing shade. But anyway, I want to say Kirk. I'm just over Kirk and Rashida. Rashida, leave Kirk. I don't care if he's the husband, your husband or your child's father. Leave him. He's obviously cheating, doing shit behind your back. Leave. Next, I want to talk about the Baltimore cops and say yes, thankfully, that they are all being charged. Sorry, I got to switch my hands for a second. They're all being charged, thankfully. 
for the murder of Freddie Gray. And justice may be served. I'm not 100% sure it's going to be served because we all know how that, that goes. <clears throat> Cop gets charged or George Zimmerman gets charged, but they don't get sentenced. So we just have to see if that happens. If it does, thankfully, you know, thank you, Lord. And if it doesn't, more shit's probably going to pop off, and I hope not. I'm going to talk about the Bulls and the Cavs, bitch. Uh, the series is tied, and I'm not sure if the Bulls can do it. Hopefully they can. I feel like they did get lucky on that first game. Second game, Brian came back and said, bitch, no, that's not going to happen twice. Third game, we have to see what's going to happen. Bulls, I do want y'all to exceed, but I feel like y'all might not. I do want to see Golden State in the finals. I want to see Golden State versus whoever makes it. The Bulls or the Cavs, basically. That's my prediction for the finals. Um, you heard it here first on Bitchy Show. I want to talk about my bae, who I haven't really talked about in a minute, I don't think. Chris Brown, bitch. Chris, um... Home Invasion, bitch. He put up an Instagram post saying, with this black bitch talking about, oh... Uh, I caught this, I caught her in my house. She spray painted my cars, my walls. She threw my daughter's clothes in the garbage. She had voodoo things all around my house. And I just want to know who this black bitch was because what's his address, girl? I need to get there. Um, she's probably going to be in jail for a minute. Hopefully she can get out. If not, damn, I need to get in contact with her. What's his address? What route did you take to get in, girl? What would you say would be the easiest route for me to make it in? Because I'll be in L.A. Um, in July. So, girl, I need to get in touch with you. <laughs> Hit me up. Twitter me. DM me. Facebook me. Instagram me. SoundCloud me. And all that. Follow me on Twitter at look at underscore D now 88. We will be back next week with more tea, more topics, and more ta-ta. <laughs> Deuces!